a group of modern-day explorers had been planning their expedition for months. They had heard rumors of a hidden cave in the heart of a remote jungle that contained an ancient sleeping dragon, and they were determined to uncover the truth. The journey to the cave was grueling. They battled through dense jungle, fought against treacherous terrain, and braved the elements. But finally, they arrived at the cave entrance. As they made their way deeper into the cave, they began to see signs of the dragon's presence, piles of gold and jewels, scorched walls and ceilings, and the unmistakable smell of sulfur. They pressed on, filled with a sense of excitement and fear. Suddenly, one of the explorers stumbled and fell, knocking over a pile of treasure. The sound echoed through the cave, waking the dragon from its slumber. In a flash, the dragon was upon them. It let out a deafening roar and breathed a stream of fire that engulfed several of the explorers. The survivors scattered, running for their lives as the dragon pursued them relentlessly. One by one, the explorers fell to the dragon's wrath. Its massive jaws closed around them, crushing their bones and leaving nothing but a pile of ash in its wake. Only one explorer remained. She was young and quick, Britter Bug was her name. She had managed to avoid the dragon's attacks by hiding in the shadows and using the piles of treasure to her advantage. As she ran through the winding passages of the cave, she stumbled upon a massive room filled with dragon eggs and gold. The sight took her breath away, she had never seen so much wealth in one place. As she emerged from the cave, she collapsed on the ground, gasping for air. She looked back at the entrance, relieved to see that the dragon had not followed her. But her relief was short-lived. She realized that she was the only survivor of the expedition, and that she had lost everything, her friends, their equipment, and her hopes of finding the dragon's treasure. As she lay on the ground, exhausted and alone, the survivor knew that they had been changed forever by their ordeal. They had faced death and emerged victorious, but at a great cost. They would never be the same again, and would always carry the scars of her adventure with her. Days turned into weeks, and the Britter Bug struggled to come to terms with what had happened. She had lost everything and everyone she had known, and was now alone in a strange and unfamiliar world. But her awe was short-lived. The dragon had caught up with her, and was now blocking the exit. The explorer knew she had only one chance, she had to slay the dragon and escape with her life. She searched desperately for a weapon, but found only a broken piece of metal lying on the ground. She picked it up and faced the dragon, ready to fight to the death. The dragon charged forward, jaws open wide. The explorer dodged to the side and plunged the makeshift weapon into its eye, sending the dragon reeling backwards in pain. It was a small victory, but it was enough. The explorer seized the opportunity and ran for the exit, heart pounding in her chest. But as time passed, she began to realize that she had gained something too, a newfound sense of strength and resilience. She had faced the dragon and won, against all odds. She had survived when everyone else had perished. With a newfound sense of purpose, the survivor began to make plans. Britter Bug would return to civilization, find new allies, and start a new expedition. She would find a way to unlock the secrets of the dragon's cave, and to uncover the true power and mystery of the ancient beast. The survivor knew that the journey ahead would be fraught with danger and uncertainty, but she was determined to see it through. She would not rest until she had uncovered the dragon's secrets and claimed its treasure for her own. With a heavy heart, she set out on her journey back to civilization. She traveled through the jungle, wary of any new dangers that might lie ahead. But as she walked, she realized that she was not alone. A small group of locals had taken notice of the survivor's arrival and had been following her from a distance. They had heard stories of the dragon and knew that the cave held great power and wealth. The survivor was hesitant at first, unsure of whether to trust the locals. But as they talked and shared their stories, she realized that they shared a common goal, to uncover the secrets of the dragon's cave and claim its treasure. Together, Britter Bug and the locals set out on a new expedition. They traveled through the jungle, facing new dangers at every turn. But with each passing day, they grew stronger and more determined. Finally, they arrived at the entrance to the dragon's cave. The survivor felt a sense of fear and excitement wash over her as she remembered her previous encounter with the dragon. 
but she knew that she had to push forward if she were to succeed. The survivor led the way into the cave, followed closely by the locals. They made their way deeper and deeper into the cave, avoiding the traps and pitfalls that had claimed so many lives before. Finally, they arrived at the massive room filled with dragon eggs and gold. The survivor felt their heart race as they gazed upon the treasure, knowing that it held the key to the dragon's secrets. But their moment of triumph was short-lived. Suddenly, the ground began to shake, and a deafening roar echoed through the cave. Britterbug looked up to see the dragon, fully awake and more powerful than ever before. She knew that they had to act quickly. She drew her sword and charged forward, knowing that she was the only one who stood a chance against the dragon's might. They battled fiercely, the survivor dodging the dragon's massive jaws and landing blows wherever they could. The locals cheered them on, using their weapons to distract the dragon and give her an opening. Finally, after what seemed like hours, Britterbug landed a fatal blow. The dragon let out a final roar and collapsed to the ground, dead. She collapsed as well, exhausted and covered in sweat and blood. But she knew that she had achieved her goal. They had slain the dragon, claimed its treasure, and unlocked the secrets of the ancient beast. The survivor and the locals gathered up as much treasure as they could carry, and began their journey back to civilization. They knew that they would be remembered as heroes, as the ones who had faced the dragon and emerged victorious. As they emerged from the jungle, she felt a sense of pride and accomplishment wash over her. She had faced death and emerged stronger for it. She had claimed the dragon's treasure and unlocked its secrets. And she knew that she would never forget the lessons she had learned along the way, about the power of determination, the strength of community, and the importance of never giving up on your dreams. Thanks for watching, press the thumbs up button below and subscribe or this dragon will eat you in your sleep.